the lake is beautiful tonight, Pat. Yeah. Did you arrange that? I did. Me and the man upstairs. But I think he's a little bit mad at me. He, the, wind, the wind's blowing a little more than he's promised. <laughs> and the waves are a little bit high. It looks good. You know, this has been a great day so far, Pat. It's really nice to see Marty wait, too, wasn't it? Oh, yeah. It sure So was. when are you going to tell me what's going on between the two of oh, you? Well, let's get the picnic basket out, and I'll tell you here in a second. Let's have a drink and re relax. Okay. Roll a doobie. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, little darling. Thank you, kind Let's sir. Go have some fun. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Okay, let me get the pit in the back. All right. I'll be right with you. You know what? I've had the best day today. That I, I can't even remember a better day. Uh, it's me been too. so much fun to reminisce and, you know, getting together with Marty and you and I together again. It was good to see Marty. Yeah. That's part of what I got to talk to you about. No, we'll do that. I'd like to hear it. I'll, I'll tell you. I'll tell you. Okay. Would you like an apple? <laughs> what happened to this apple? <laughs> Have you had this since Christmas? I, I think so, yeah. I, mean, I, I think one of the girls at the office It's a little it wrinkly, me. you know. <laughs> well, this half's still probably good. Oh, I'll try it. You know, remember the old days when we was running up and down the road, we'd be glad to have that apple. Mm -hmm. And we'd share it with one of our horses, wouldn't yes, we? Yes, we would. How about a little wine? Sounds good to me. Mm. I'll make a toast. Just together again. And just to a lot of love and love making. I will drink to that. Here's to you. Because I love you. God, I love you good. Here's to God who made you. I just wish you'd have this wind died down for us. <laughs> Let's get out of the wind. What do you say? Sounds good. It's to making me. my throat sore. Let's get back in the truck. Okay. We have plenty of room in the truck. Oh, this feels better sitting in here. Yeah, we used to don't have that old wind blowing in our face. I couldn't hardly keep my damn hat on. <laughs> yes, cowboy. The cowboys can't go without their hats, you know that. I know that. Yeah. So, you know, this has been fun. I mean, reminds me of it. Maybe you don't remember. Remember the time, you know, you snuck out of the house and, you know, 17 years old maybe, and I was 25 or so. We went up to Flagstaff for the rodeo. Or the time we used to go across state lines even. Boy, boy. Today I'd have to arrest the people that I caught doing that, you know? <laughs> Times change. They do. I don't know the way I remember it, we did that quite often. I think a few different <laughs> times. I, I was almost sure that Daddy was going to catch me, you know? I remember the time when we went down to Santa Fe and my horse came up lame. <laughs> yeah. And, you know, Daddy could never figure that one out. <laughs> I mean, he's still scratching his head up there I, I over that one. Is. Yeah, I mean, you know. <laughs> Boy, we had a lot of fun, Pat, didn't we? Gosh, we sure did. I kind of wish, you know, we did just went off together. Took us took off and left. Two. But we didn't, you know. And I left. I, I first I joined the Navy. Then I became a Navy SEAL. And after that I was in the CIA. Oh well, I, I still rodeo and ran around the country, but you know, there was a bunch of cowboys that's, you know, they're doing their drugs, they're selling drugs, trading drugs, hauling drugs, stealing airplanes. Yeah, I remember some of those days. Well, me and but Marty and... Uh, why wouldn't you have told me? I, you know, I don't know. I don't know, just... Uh, thinking my country needed me to be quiet, I don't, I, I don't know, honest to God, I don't know. I didn't know what to say to you. You know, I... I'm so damn sorry the way I, I handled the whole thing. I didn't call, I didn't write. Yeah. And I loved and missed you every minute I was gone. And I'm being attacked by a mosquito. <laughs> <laughs> I've been wanting to ask you anyway. 
Didn't you ever date anybody after I took off? Well, I, I did date Matt Reed for a spell. Matt Reed? Jesus, Chrissy. Matt Reed? <laughs> well, it was no big deal. Uh. Believe me, it was no big deal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, okay. Well, this, this is now, and that was then. What do you think we should do about it now? Well, what would you like to do about it? Well, I really don't know either, but we're both getting older. It's too late for a family, that's for sure. But oh, yeah. you know, I would just—I would just like to spend some more quality time with you. Yeah, and you know, like go to fun things like barrel racing. Oh and stuff. yeah, <laughs> we can sure as hell do that. Hmm. Maybe we can get you mounted up again. I'd love to do that. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm a good cowgirl. Yes, you are. You always were. Mm -hmm. That might be part of the reason I loved you so much. Loved? Loved. You still love me, don't you, Pat? I do. Because I sure love your cowboy ass. <laughs> I always have and I always will. Thank you. Still got so, a little bad news. So, yeah, you can tell me what was the other thing that you mentioned you wanted to clear well, the air about? Well, Greg Pettit, you know. Yeah, my bouncer. Yeah. Well, they found him murdered last night. Murdered. Murdered. My God, Pat. Where? Did, where? Oh, out there by the old western town, out the, you know, on down the road from your bar. It's been, you know, one thing after another, these murders, uh, but now it's it pretty close to home. What do we do about this, Pat? What are we going to do? Chrissy, we're going to get them fuckers. You promise? I do promise. He was a nice person. He was, but I'm right my here. God. I'm not gonna let you out of my sight. We'll get him. Oh, Pat. I'm so sorry. 